can you describe press week in three words? Intense, fun, and tedious. <laughs> Satisfying once it's done. It's a Ooh, fun. We'll say family, hectic, busy. I wouldn't say hectic, it's more focused. Work, work, work. Working, working, and Um, serious? <laughs> It's just really serious. <laughs> Who missed the deadline on this issue without saying their name? Advisor. I think I know. I'm like me. I missed my deadline several times. <laughs> they asked when the deadline was. <laughs> Who missed the deadline? Did somebody really? <laughs> I don't know. Did they? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> I do not know. So, I did my work. I'm no, <laughs> period. I've always liked that. Every time they say something in the group of like, oh, like this is our deadline, like Saturday hard deadline, I'm just like, I already put my work, so I'm. That's not me. <laughs> this just like cool guy or whatever, you know. Like like him a lot, but like he didn't do any like assignment, which is okay. So, but you know, our job is kind of really easy, so. You know, gotta get those flicks in. Which two people do you think are most likely to have a heated debate in the newsroom? You see, I'm still getting, like, uh, used to everyone. I'm still getting to know everyone. It's my first year, but from what I know... Natalie and Lewis. Yeah. Natalie. Is that her name? Nat? Yeah. Because I think she knows what she wants, and she's very on top of everything, and those are the kind of people that are good at arguments. <laughs> those are the kind of people that know how to speak their mind. Yeah, so okay. good for her. <laughs> yeah, she knows what she wants. I would definitely say Lewis. This is something that Jennifer brought to my knowledge, is that Mac is like, like a straightforward person, and I'm like, okay. Ooh, Lewis. <laughs> I feel like Lewis has a very strong news personality where like the rest of us are more chill and we would just like sit back and like listen to him like rant about something. And Eric, they would butt heads and they would like definitely be like, Arr! definitely have a heated debate. What is one thing you want to change about the newsroom? Maybe how much we push out, how much content we push out. I think if we pushed out a lot more. Damn, you stumped me there. Involving everybody, you know, like one of the words that I said was that we're kind of like a family And I think sometimes we do need to change that involving everybody and explaining things and being more like Also educating and teaching each other instead of just being like, oh, here's how you do it You know, we guide each other on how to do it instead of being like, oh For example, we could be like, oh, like go write a news article But somebody could be like, oh, but what are the main points in writing a news article? Right. Like you said, we're not writing essays, we're writing articles. Like, how can we help somebody not write an essay, but write an article? Make it bigger. I think we should get some better lighting in here. It, it should be a little bit more warm. Warm? Okay. <laughs> warm, we need more warm lighting. Warm lighting. Had more workshops. I think if we had more, um, like, workshops where we actually wrote things down, not just slideshows, but things that we genuinely like worked through and had maybe things to edit. Like, I think that would be really helpful. Kind of like homework? Yeah, well not homework, but I mean, we take the meetings and we mostly talk through our meetings. So I'm like, maybe if we just took a certain section of that and just did to like working on past stories that could be corrected or um, just things that they could give us to help us improve our writing or our editing that would be nice because i think that's kind of where people most struggle with right. unless they're consistently doing it themselves exactly. you know okay that's really good wow <laughs> real deep and off the record oh my god i like how it is right now oh my god. everyone's really friendly which i really like like the first day i came in i was like everyone is just looking that's how i felt right. but like i got to talk to everyone and yeah everyone's really nice yeah. and yeah i got acclimated faster than I thought I would. Okay. So, yeah. yeah, I like that, that's good. What inspired you to join Viewpoints? I always wanted to be a writer. I love writing. Always had trouble writing essays. <laughs> but like, in my head, I always like pictured articles and like stuff that I want to write about. I was a film major and I took a news production class and I really liked it. So. I felt like journalism was the only thing that was gonna keep me in school. I'm not the best student and I'm um, a huge procrastinator, but what really keeps me going is knowing that I'm interested in this. Okay, and the last question, how are you liking being a part of the Viewpoints team? It's just been super cool. 
Uh, everybody's been like super chill. And so I, I can't complain. I, I, don't, I only have good things to say about being a part of Viewpoint. I love, I love the people. Professor Varal is always like really nice and supportive and just having that is, um, it's nice to know that she's always around. Yeah. So that's cool. I like it, I really enjoy it. <laughs> At a beginner level, I think this is really helpful. And I think if anybody wants to be a writer, but you know, doesn't know where to start, I think Viewpoints is definitely like a good beginner, like beginner friendly newspaper. Everyone is here because they want to be here totally. and that they want to report. And I mean, at least compared to high school, people were like there because they need to take an elective, you know? No, yeah. <laughs> and it makes college life even more fun. You get more involved. And I think that everyone should try it out if they have a passion for things like that. I love it. Boom, 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 <laughs> boom, 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 boom. I don't care, boom, but I love it. Whoa, I don't care, whoa. I love it, I love it, I love it.